Okay, I'm Rich at uh, New Life Scientific. We went ahead and pulled the gene back down, and I know you wanted to see it run for the last time before we ship it. So I've got ahead, gone ahead and set it all up, and we've got all the temperatures all ready to go. It's been running here for about uh, 15, 20 minutes now, so everything's pretty much ready. Um, so we're just gonna go ahead and put some water in. I've got a couple microplates um, on each side here just to balance the bottom row out. So we're gonna fill the microplates up with water and then we're just gonna run a, a, a program on it and show you everything's working. It's gonna just pull all the moisture, evaporate everything out and put it over in the condenser and then we'll get some video shots of that after we run, make the run. But right now I'm just gonna go ahead and fill up all of the wells with water. And you could actually stack multiple plates on, on top too. But we're just gonna do these. You could actually even put inserts in these and um, that would hold um, different kind of tubes. So there's a lot of options you can do with this. should have it fairly balanced so the microplates um, shall spin uh, with no vibrations so just let me go ahead and close the door all right secure all right now I've just I've already set the program and uh, all I got to do is pretty much hit start it's gonna Go ahead and start pulling uh, the pressure down and spinning up the, you can see the screen here where it's starting on the graphs already, showing the speeds. But we'll let this run a while and uh, come back and maybe take a shot of the screen and then of course come back and um, at the end of the cycle and show you how it Everything evaporated and went into the condenser. We'll be back shortly. All right, so we've ran a, um, a program on it and um, we're looking to have all the water evaporated. Um, it should have went from here into the condenser there. But I just went ahead and shut it down a little bit ago and let everything spin down. But you can look at the panel here where we had a, I pulled the vacuum all the way down to a zero and it ran for quite a while. And then the heat was up pretty high here too, but once I shut it down, of course, the vacuum all bled off here, and then the, um, the heat also dropped on there. But anyways, we're gonna go ahead and open this up and take a look inside. It's really nice and warm in here because I ran the temperatures fairly high. But uh, as you can see, uh, we don't have anything left, um, some powder residue. So, Look at the other one, same thing. And so everything's been evaporated really nice. Everything's completely dry. But uh, it seems to be working great. Um, I'll do a purge on it here in a little bit, but um, I think you'll be well satisfied with it.